Yo, what's up, people? It's your boy. I'm Christy Don One, and I am back with another video. I got three stories related to hip hop news. I, I decided to upload all three of these videos on one, so you guys are getting a treat from the man. I'm Chris the Don One, but here we go. The first story, and this story has not been confirmed nor denied, and it's really weighing heav heavily to uh, denied, but 50 Cent, Mr. G, -G, 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 -G Unit, is said to believe to sign Miss Ooh, Miss Young Ma. <laughs> Uh, 50 Cent is signing this rapper to G Unit. Now, what do I think about this? I really don't think that this rumor is based on reality. I think this is a factuation. Uh, there's a lot of fans in the G Unit camp uh, that's uh, pulling this rumor and trying to spread this rumor on social media. Me, personally, I don't think that this rumor is true, but 50 Cent is supposed to be signing this uh, female, all right? Now, what do I think about it is simple. I just don't see her fitting with the G-Unit style, all right? Uh, you know, G-Unit is kind of a flirtatious type of a uh, street slash glamorous type of feel to it. And I just don't see the two world the two worlds uh utilizing. I see it more of a collision, but I just don't think that this rumor is real about G Unit signing young. Alright. So we're gonna move on to the next topic. Little Wayne is said to be signed to Rockefeller. Now, at a recent concert, he threw the rock up, and a lot of people are saying that uh, Jay Z signed Lil Wayne to uh, you know Rockefeller. Now, to me, well, yeah, well, Rock Nation. To me, uh, I think this is going to be a difficult task because. I don't believe Birdman is going to release Lil Wayne from uh, Cash Money, Young Money, because if he does that, then he's also going to have to entertain the notion of, uh, you know, Drake as well as Nicki Minaj possibly uh, signing with Lil Wayne or probably signing to other labels. Uh, you know, Birdman is a smart businessman. Uh, there's really uh, no, you know, prime reason why little, I mean, Birdman would do this, all right? Now, Birdman's not going to be pressured into doing something he doesn't want to do. And Little Wayne is a very important asset to young money slash cash money. But you know, like I said, these rumors are not confirmed nor denied, all right? So we're going to move on to the last story of the day. And a lot of people are, you know, especially on social media, is throwing mad shade at Miss Little Kim. Uh, she did a recent video saying that she has a little Spanish in her, and she quoted a Spanish song on this video. And a lot of people are replying that, uh, Little Kim is denouncing the fact that she is no longer African American. Basically, calling Little Kim is doing some coonery. All right, and uh, <laughs> uh, when I saw the video, uh, Little Kim wasn't even entertaining that type of vibe that she is denouncing herself. Uh, that she's no longer going to claim herself as an African American. Uh, I thought the video was cute. I thought that uh, you know her. Saying some rhymes in Spanish is, is awesome. And maybe Little Kim would do a collaboration doing some hip-hop type, Spanish type music on her next album. That's what I took from this uh, video. Now, as far as, you know, Little Kim uh, denouncing the fact that she's not African-American, I think this room, I mean, I think this story got legs on social media and a lot of people on social media is going in on little Kim. She didn't say anything like that. She didn't apply anything like that. 
and you will have to see the video for yourself. It's up on YouTube. So just go to the video, watch the raw, uncut video, and I don't think little... Well, I know for a fact Little Wayne didn't... I mean, Little Wayne. Little Kim didn't say anything to that nature, all right? So you guys got three stories in one freaking video. Isn't that awesome for a Monday morning? It's your boy. I'm Krista Don Juan, and I am out. This is...